there are a couple plays there where you know we might have been a little sloppy. It didn't take us too long to to get into it though. Once we started, uh, um, you know, got some big goals there that uh, really got us going. And uh, you know, I felt as though you know minus uh, minus a couple rush plays that uh, maybe we had a, a couple breakdowns in the neutral zone. Uh, for the most part, I think we played the right way the, whole, the entire night, and we were able to you know finish them off and uh, you know not really take our foot off the gas to the point where we kind of let them back in. So uh, we had some solid games from a lot of guys. That was Bruins newcomer Drew Stafford, who was able to secure his first goal in the black and gold uniform. What appeared to be a slow start for the Bruins quickly switched gears as they were able to secure a four-goal lead in the first period. Bruins' Brad Marchand speaks to the team's effort. We didn't have a great start. Uh, the first five minutes, five, six minutes, they uh, were the better team, but uh, we did a really good job of bouncing back from that and, and uh, establishing a four-check and, and uh, we, we got a few goals after that. Brad Marchand also spoke to us about the high tempo of play that was maintained throughout the game, how the team continues to show up, and what he expects for the last 15 games of the season. But uh, you know, once we we had the pressure on them, and we were turning a lot of pucks over, and uh, you know we're we're playing with that tempo right now. And uh, when uh, the deer moving the puck up the way they are, they did a great job at uh, putting us in a position where we can make plays. And um, you know it's gonna be a high tempo game. That's that's what we want. And, and uh, when we forecheck the way we are and, and turn the pucks over like that, then uh, we're gonna get a lot of opportunities. And, and we did tonight. I uh, haven't bounced back games, and and uh, guys are showing up right now. So. That's all we need uh, going down the stretch. There's you know, 15 games or so left, and uh, we need to make sure that we're consistent down the stretch and, and uh, we're not losing, like I said, multiple games. The Bruins were able to capitalize on an opportunity to earn two points and defeat the struggling Detroit Red Wings, who sit at the bottom of the Eastern Conference standings. Next up, the Bruins will face the Philadelphia Flyers this Saturday at a matinee at the TD Garden. Reporting for Bruins Daily, I'm Amanda Soucy. Belong, we belong together, we stand proud and true. Remember when I said that I'd always be